guys, welcome back. So I'm just going to tie his wee pearly wet fly. Much like a blade in black if you like. Now the hook in the base is a Camazon B175 in size 10. The thread that I'm going to use is Uni380 in black. So I'm just going to come in and get the thread started. Just behind the other hook and we'll just going to work our thread down until we're past the point of the hook. Remove the waist tag. The tail, just looking some uh, tippet fibers, GP tippet fibers. It's, these ones here are just dyed a, a hot orange. But you could use whatever colour you like. I'm just looking at a, a sparse bunch. I'm just going to tie them in over the back, around about the, the length of the body or so. Now, see if you keep a hold of the, the tippet fibers and work your thread down, it'll stop them from. Span out only. Just work your thread down until you're at the bar of the hook. Trim that the length of the body. Then the wire. You're looking some uh, silver wire. This is the. Oh, you're lost there. The vineyard. So it's just a copper wire with a nickel plating. So I'm just going to take a wee piece of this here off. that in the body. Just want to use some large opal mirage tinsel. I'm using the opal mirage and the black thread for a reason. It's to, to get that nice dark like a bottle green colour if you like. Just the shade you get off it. And I'm just working the thread forward, tying in the cut ends of the GP fibers, grass fibers, the mirage, the wire. Now we're just going to bring up the mirage first. So it's got a nice tight turn at the back and then just overlapping turns of the oval mirage up the body. Follow that around with our thread, a couple of nice tight turns come in from where the waist. Now the body haggle. This is just the one of the speed haggles <coughs> to show you off this mats cape. So we're just going to catch that in, fold the stem back, break away the stem of the haggle, and then we're just going to polymer this down the body. I think they get two turns going at the shoulder of the fly, and then you're looking, I don't know four or five turns, it's up to you. It also depends on the length of the haggle here. So I should get four turns okay to there. And I want to keep that tip of that haggle tight. Follow it around with your silver wire. And then you're looking four turns up the body. Sweep everything back nice and tight. Bring the wire up in front. Follow that around with your thread. And I just like the Take my thread down to the other hook, bend and break away the wire, and come in and trim away the tip of the haggle at the back. Slick your haggle fibers back at this point and work your thread back up in the position. Now the wing, this is wood pigeon, so you just need a, a right and a left fowler. Now I've just got the wee slips off just to sort of way try and speed the, the process up a wee bit here in relation to the video. So just get your your right and your left slip now. What I would say to you is guys I don't chase perfection with these type of flies, not unless you're framing them, that's different. But see these? This material, this will completely disintegrate. See, once you start catching fish on this wee fly, now we're just going to offer it up. Get the get the length out like a good wing on this wee pearly pattern. Just come in, pinch it right with a pinching loop. Take a couple of turns just to see what way we are. Now, 
the wing at the far side has dropped. So just come back off again. It's no big deal. Come back in. Get your fibers sort of way lined up again. The best you can. Offer these up to the offer these up to the hook. Just pinch them and save the hook. Follow around with the pinching out. A couple of tight turns. And just have a check. Make sure you're you're happy with you on. Come in and lift the fibers up, the waist ends, I mean, trim those away. Now, just tighten up with another couple of turns at this point. Don't be covering the, the end yet, you'll just make the head too big. You can do that in a wee second once we tie the hackle in. In the front hackle, you're just looking at it's just a black hen hackle. Just off a cheap Indian hen cape. Get them from vineyards. So just offer it up. Take a couple of turns heading down. Flip the stem. Now see why you're down. See the cut ends at the front. Your thread's ready at the eye. Just build that up over the top. And that will cut down in bulk. In relation to the head. Then just fold the, the fibers back. And the turns of haggle here are entirely up to you. I'm going to put on probably three turns this flies for me so just to there now follow this around with your thread catching in the stem of the haggle a couple of turns will hold that in fold the stem of the haggle back and then just build your thread back up over the top of the stem and the haggle itself break that away keep your thread tight don't let it go just come straight in and the lash in a work finish. Pull the thread tight, come in, trim away your tan thread. And that's the wee fly done. Eh, it's going to be a wee look at it. It's going to be fly that. So, size 10, be fishing that on the point. If you want to tie them on a 12, um, I would be fishing that on the middle dropper. Eh, just to seal up the, the head. Just a wee drop of varnish, just a wee bit of fluff in there, take that out, that'll just cause me problems later on. So just to varnish the whole way around. So size 12 on the middle dropper I would suggest, size 14, you can fish this as a wee bob fly, but you probably need to put on around about 6 turns, 6-7 like turns of haggle down the body just to give it that movement you want to see in the water. So there you go guys, wee simple pearly white fly, but like a, a blend black or a variant of it if you like. Um, so look, tie a few of those up, let me know how you get on. Um, as always, many thanks for taking the time to view the video, it's greatly appreciated. And until the next one, please stay safe, look after each other, look after the families, and uh, where there are now, so tight lanes for the 2023 fishing season, anybody from that's viewing the videos from Northern Ireland. See you in the next one, guys. Bye.